I don't know if this counts as one of the things that you just mentioned mm. about people taking and not acknowledging, mm. but um, Cartier eyeglasses. Mm -hmm. Is that, would that be considered one That's of the things? That's definitely one of the things. You knew that. Can you explain the history behind the Cartier eyeglass culture of Detroit? Right. Even like, all right, like I wouldn't even dip it as far as into like the whole thing with the Cartiers, but this specifically white buffs, like that's Detroit shit. Like, nigga, white buffs is Detroit shit. You feel me? Like, that's Detroit shit. Like, now you see all these suckers, man. Like, and they be having the buffs look all cheesy. My like, man, that shit just fucked up, Smalls. When you say cheap, what's an example of cheesy? Like, you know what I mean? Like, bro, niggas just be having on bus with whatever, thinking bus can just say the whole situation, bro. Like, these niggas know the bus come with certain shit. It's like buffs with the wham, with the wham. Niggas just buffs. Stupid ass niggas just got on buffs. You don't need buffs too big. The bitches sliding off your face at those stupid big lenses. Niggas don't even know how to properly get they buffs like nigga you don't even know how to get your buffs for you like that shit is you know it's more of a science than niggas think that's how you can tell when it's just a dilly old like oh man how does one figure that out it's just easy like even being down here they can tell like i'm a detroit nigga like, i guess it's just a thing do you own a pair of white buffs yourself I'm done with the buffs. I fade in and out of buffery, but I'll probably buy some more buffs next month. But right now, I'm done with buffs. Why? Shit, it was just like, shit, I done broke damn near four, five pair of buffs, lost buffs. And it ain't like a thing where you be done with, like, with, like me. Like, when I say I'm done with them, it just be like, I'm on the buff break. Like, I started my whole, like, when I first started rapping, all my videos, buffs. Like, I damn near, like, damn, I don't, like, I gotta look like me. That's why I don't wear buffs as much. Cause like the first half of my career was just like the hair and the buffs. Like I had to take the buffs off. Did you ever uh, customize your buffs? Yeah, I done put ice in buffs before. But that shit, like I don't like them like that personally just cause just dealing with them bitches on your face like that. Now, when it comes to buffs, uh, you mentioned here where you said some people's lenses don't fit their face, they're choosing the wrong kind of buffs, and, and this, that, and the third. Mm. But what about when it comes to fake buffs? That's a crime. You trifling. You a hoe. Ain't nothing that, that's what it's really come down to fake buffs. If you own a pair of fake buffs, listen here. Matter of fact, <clears throat> look, this is me, All-Star JR, a real Detroit nigga. And what's so crazy, it is how serious buffs is. Like, how I ain't got on my buffs, but let me see, bro. It's buffs around, bro. It's always buffs around. If you got a fake pair of these, you as a hoe. Because the feeling of putting on the real pair of these, Smalls, when you, when you look through the buffs, bro, like let's say it was a bitch and she had a boyfriend. When you put the buffs on, no boyfriend. You feel me? Period. Like, that's what the buffs do, Smalls. Like, Smalls, if you put the buffs on, bro, you would probably be in this bitch playing so crazy. You would probably spark up in this bitch. Like, you know what? I ain't tripping about that shit. I pay that shit. I'm small. Quit playing. You feel me? That's the thing about the buffs. See, now you go, when I get home, now I'm about to have to go buy some more buffs. All right, see, I hadn't put buffs on in about a month. I'm feeling good. For real, be like, go down there, smack the shit out the receptionist. Excuse me, sir, bitch, I can't do nothing but wear my buffs. You hear me? Fuck around with a hoe. As a matter of fact, we doing a residence interview with Buff. This is gonna okay. be your first. This is gonna be your first interview where a nigga wore two face outfits. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> this Buff are. I'm really about to get my bag on my ass. Yeah. <laughs> now, when it comes to the subject of fake buffs, how can one spot the difference? Oh man, there's so many ways, but they they tightening up the fake buffs though. But no, like bitches be big, big as hell. Like damn, the arms of them buffs big. You, niggas, niggas wearing buff buffs, <laughs> strong buffs. Like, you know, I get some fake ass buffs. Then them bitches long, your shit wrapping all around the bottom of your ear and shit. Like, you got them candy cane buffs with the hook <laughs> on the bitch. <laughs> you hear me? Niggas wearing them candy cane buffs. Come on, man.
No, man, go on out. People have died over this stuff. People are dying over these bitches right now. Bro, Detroit's so fucked up, a nigga probably just got his buff snatched as we speak. <laughs> There's some buffs gone right now, this one. And I would imagine... Or a nigga getting popped at with some buffs on. And I would imagine what would make it worse than a death from a, a pair of these cardiac eyeglasses. That the bitches be in fake. Yeah. Like, damn. Nigga done popped your top for the fake buffs. That's why you a hoe if you even own something. Because you, know, you putting you and other people in danger, bro. Think of the Jack Boys. Them niggas out hunting, you know what I'm saying? You out right with your fake ass buffs. This nigga done caught you slipping. He done bust your head. He done got caught locked up. The bus fake. Nobody was supposed to be in that position. You know what I'm saying? It was you want to get these fake ass buffs to confuse everybody. That's why if you got the bitches, you a hoe. You a high risk. Like, bro, if you would go get some fake buffs, you high risk, bro. I can't fuck with you fake buff wearing niggas. You don't even want to see shit right. You a hoe.